Root access once again. This is part three, a bonus bonus part. Okay. This is what you get for uh, being a loyal fan. Part three. You don't have to pay extra for this. No, this one's included. This one's free. We bundle. It's a bundling discount. Uh, we've talked about the FireWire report disappearing on the MacBook. Mm -hmm. You know, FireWire supports things like target drive and, and um, or target disk mode. Yep. So from a genius perspective and uh, machine maintenance or mm -hmm. troubleshooting, what problems arise without FireWire? Well, the nice thing with FireWire was, um, tar I mean, tar the big thing was target disk mode. So every, every computer you could put in target disk mode, the computer basically becomes a FireWire hard drive. And how that would um, come in handy is one, you could use it to um, pull data off a computer that, for example, had a bad logic board. A lot of times target disk mode would still function or, mm -hmm. or the screen wasn't working. Um, you could also use it to uh, when imaging a computer. So, I mean, the consumer, most consumers aren't going to miss that feature. But from, you know, an administrative standpoint, it definitely hurts. The, the new MacBooks, you know, the hard drives are easily removed now. Cool. So it looks like that's probably going to be the way to go, pulling drives. Um, another feature that's, I guess, changed now is the data, uh, the migration assistant when mm -hmm. you boot up the new Mac. So it won't work over FireWire. It'll work over um, Ethernet, which will probably take a little bit longer and might require, I haven't used that myself yet, but it might require some configuration. Right. Um, and you'll need the dongle in the air. Because you yep, you need a dongle. Um, I mean, the good thing is the new Macs support USB booting. So you could still boot the computer from an external drive mm -hmm. that had an operating system on it. So that's sort of a way of But there's no, there's no key shortcut. Like target disk mode, you have T for yeah. the FireWire target disk mode. With USB, it's just basically um, you would have to be able to get to the screen where you select. Yeah, you hold the option key when you okay. boot it. And you'd, well, you'd need, yeah, and then you choose the USB drive that has the OS installed. OK. Um, so I mean, that, that sort of helps you out, because you can still image a computer that way. Uh, but FireWire is going to be missed, I think, in you know, in school districts at the Genius Bar, certainly. We'll miss it. We would send it an iCard, but uh, <laughs> they took away the iCards too. <laughs> Can't even send it an iCard. Oh well. There you go. Bonus coverage, everyone. Uh, thanks for watching. Don't forget, if you have a question, send it in to root at thedigitallifestyle.tv. We'll see you next time.